Hey guys, me Adam Man here. Today we're going to talk about how to adjust the cable on the emergency brake handle. Now this by no means is an adjustment of the rear calipers. This is very important to know. The rear calipers on this car and rear brakes have just been done. The calipers are adjusted properly, but uh, my friend Mark, whose car this is, he wants this just to come up a little bit less. So I'm going to show you how to adjust that. First thing we're going to need is a Phillips number two screwdriver. We're going to put it in right here. That'll undo the screw that holds the clamshell together that goes around the e-brake handle here. That's what that screw looks like. It's actually the same screw that holds the visors in place and it's tapered. So there you are. Once we have that off, we can spread this apart. It's probably not been off in a long time. So let's sort of pull the two halves apart like this. Ooh, lots of stuff on there. This is actually a great time to clean out this area down here too. There's gonna be all sorts of coins and food and God knows what else in there. So once we have that off, I'll show you a close up of it. That's what it looks like. That little part here goes through this little hole here. So that is actually where the screw goes through. So the screw goes through this side and it actually threads in to that part there. So when you have this correctly reinstalled, it sort of has a channel there, as you can see. It slides together and it has these little, tiny little posts here and they fit into these little holes here. So when you're putting this back on, be careful that you get it snapped in properly. So once that's off, then you can see what's going on in here. So I'm gonna pick you up here and take you in. There we go. So as you can see, hey look, there's money. So this is a small amount of money. This I've opened these things up and there's been all sorts of coins in there. I think I found about 10 bucks worth of change in one of them. So that was a penny. Let's get that out. Okay, yeah, so not much in there, it's pretty clean. So the thing what we're gonna do is look for this here. That's a 10 millimeter bolt. And that's what adjusts the cable. So we slide our wrench on here. And if we turn it clockwise, it'll, it'll tighten up that cable. So you wanna go slow and then sort of see how that adjustment is. So what we're doing is we're shortening the throw on this handle. So you don't have to pull it up quite as high. Now, as I mentioned earlier, this is something that you want to make sure that you're not trying to adjust your brakes by doing this, because this isn't what it's for. This is just to adjust how much this pulls up when you, uh, when you engage the parking brake. The caliper adjustment's a different video, and that's uh, one that you have to actually do at the caliper on this car. So there you are. I like the way that looks now. That looks pretty good. Yeah, it's a nice tight. Yeah, it engages right there, and then you can pull it up a bit more, and that's completely off. So I would say that that is adjusted as much as we should. We don't want to adjust that anymore. Otherwise, they'll, that cable will be actuating before this even moves. So there we are. So that's a nice tight adjustment on that. Now, now that that's done, we need to reinstall the clamshell that goes around it. So we're going to line this post here up with the hole. Let me slide that on. Make sure that it's in place. Sorry for the shaky camera work. I'm doing this one-handed right now. So, so we get that in place and then you clip this on over the handle like that. Now once you've got both pieces in place, it's a matter of kind of working them together. Because you want these two pieces to line up perfectly. Right here. There we go. 
Okay. Now, at the back here, there we go. When you have it lined up, it all snaps together nicely when you squeeze it. And that looks pretty good right now. That's all there the way it should be. It's working well. And it's grabbing perfectly as well. So now don't forget to put in the Phillips screw that you took out. That goes right in this hole here. Now don't over tighten it because it will strip the plastic receiver that goes into the back. So you just want to put it in firmly. Yeah, just like that. And there you are. That is how you adjust your throw on your parking brake handle on your 1990 all the way up to 05 Mazda Miatas. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. Uh, watch for more videos coming soon. And hit the like and subscribe buttons too, please. Talk to you later.